Houston Rocket team, and we'll see what kind of start the uh, Knicks get off to here. They struggled in their last ball game against San Antonio. Really fell apart in the fourth quarter. For three spot for Houston, but Carl Herrera, a young guy coming out of the University of Houston in Europe, will get playing time, and Elijah Wan open scoring for the Rockets. Charles Daniel against Buck Johnson. Xavier gets his first bucket of the night. Nice hit. Should have scored with that four on two break. Very flat on that shot. This is not pretty basketball. <laughs> Back it in on Xavier McDaniel. Now Mark Jackson straight to the hoop with the easy layup. Nobody there to defend it. See, this is a problem right there for New York. The double and triple teams on Patrick Ewing. Maxwell to Kenny Smith for the lay-in. The turnovers that leads to fast to New York. Charles Oakley will do that. He'll be on the floor. He'll go for every loose ball. Mark Jackson intelligently knew that that shot clock was still running. It was... And screen roll again. You see the rotation. Ewing now on Elijah Wan. Inside the paint. From... He's quick, 10 feet. fades back, shoots that jump shot. You cannot bother that jump shot. Once he gets in the air, you're not going to block that jump shot. The only thing you can do is get a hand in the face and hopefully disturb him. Daniel to Gerald Wilkins out of the corner. Nobody near Gerald, and he sinks the uncontested. Rockets by four. Ewing against Elijah Wan. That's what the people bought the tickets to see. And Patrick has his first two of the night. Rockets by two. Thorpe out in front on the break. A nice body control by Otis Thorpe. If they get hurt inside with this smaller lineup, they're going to go try to, try to go right at Thorpe. Elijah Wan from long range. That was about a 20-footer. He has six points now. John is catching. Four on three. Mason gets the lay-in. Got down inside. Nowhere to go with it. Keying a New York break. Nice pass. Mason from see, Mark Jackson. You see the speed out on the break, Mason? He thinks he is the three-man of the future for this team. Must have guys on the floor shoot the basketball. Sleepy Floyd from long range. Bullard gets it to Herrera. Goes to his left hand. Well, not pretty right now for Pat Riley. Herrera from Sleepy Floyd. Four points early for Carl Herrera. Starks to Vandeweghe, open from the baseline. And you give him that shot, he'll make eight out of ten open shots. Kiki Vandeweghe can really shoot the basketball. Well, Vandeweghe with a rebound to Anthony. To Ewing. He has four. Baskets, Ewing running out, getting an easy basket. They must be able to get a few more of those for every game. Elijah Wan slid down inside to get the easy lob pass, and he draws the foul. So a three-point opportunity for Akeem. He's fouled by Mason. Good defense. Rebound by Kiki Vandeweghe. Gets the ball out ahead. You see Ewing running the floor nicely. The look-ahead pass by Greg Anthony. And the big fellow finishes it up on the end. So you got to get your big guy some easy baskets like that. Max only needs one to get it off, though. That's right. He's looking for it. Four, three, two. Thorpe from 18. Off the glass. I heard him call it. You could just see that bank coming. He called it. Eight points. Dribbling and a prayer. That'll get you some bench time. Kenny Smith, nice job taking care of the ball. So when you take a bad shot, you get bad floor balance. He over-penetrated, and he ended up shooting a shot with two guys on him, which is going to lead to a fast break. And an auto stork jam. You, you got to take the outside jump shot. You just have to take it. You can't drive in there against a shot-blocking team because every time they've done that, Bob, it's been sound the trumpets and go the other way. Thorpe has 10. Houston has an 11-point lead. Knicks will struggle to get 40 points in the half. Think of it. Wilkins with the Oakley pick. To Ewing from 8 feet. That's a nice job by Wilkins. He got Elijah. Ewing. First half. Good ball rotation. Buck Johnson. See, excellent patience. Three passes. Wide open shot. That, that will make the highlight film open jump shot. Needs to take it to the basket. Jamerson for three. Big bucket for Jamerson. And what a quick release. Well, that'll end the half. The Knicks never did get to 40. Rockets 47. Knicks 39. Absolutely, the passes have just been, uh, you know, rolling around on the floor. Nothing has been real crisp. And that's 11. 
Ewing, hard-earned basket. That was a nice move by Patrick Ewing. He felt the contact rolling where they're trailing, and they'll go up to Dallas to play tomorrow night. Maxwell on the drive and the hoop. He has him back to Wilkins. Elijah Wan lead pass to Kenny Smith. And Elijah Wan's ninth rebound leads. We think that's going <laughs> Tend to shoot. <laughs> he backed out for the three. Hey. <laughs> what did Don Chaney said? Don said he can be something like one for seven or one of eight, which he was in the first half at one point. Come to the bench and think he's playing. That's great. absolutely. Coach on the post against Herrera. Now looking for Ewing against Tree Rollins. Rollins played him well, but Ewing scored. It's a five-point game. Had a good job circling the post to get the steal. Elijah won. Held on to the ball. Some strength involved there as they try to knock it out of his well, hands. You, you had that defensively, and then he got some big scores for him. So he's a he's a big reason the bench is playing so well. Quinette with the steal ahead to Starks. Maxwell is there, but Starks with the jam. Pass. Five seconds to shoot. Maxwell, <laughs> he's the man with three. And oh, Sleepy got away with another one. Sleepy to Elijah Wong. Got away with a little bit of a hop there on that drive. Led to two points for, for Hakeem. Looking for Ewing. This is where someone's got to make a shot outside. Patrick working so hard. I don't know how he got that shot off. He squeezed it off. But Looking for their first win of the year. The loss to Maxwell from Sleepy Floor. The most exciting play of the night there. Beautiful play, well executed back screen and perfect pass. This is set up now. You see the back screen. Here comes the back screen. Looks like Otis Thorpe and Mason does not talk. He does not release and give help. Starks is trailing. The play is wide open. So that was a perfectly executed play and a great pass from Sleepy Floyd. Five to shoot. Maxwell mm. will entertain. About a 7.5 on that reverse jam, and Maxwell has 20 points. He has really come alive in the second half. 7.18 remaining from the summit in Houston. 16 points before he can get back in the ball game. Nice give and go. He's going with the lay-in, and it is a 16-point Rockets lead. Herrera. Passing to Elijah Wan. Good ball mover. Four passes on that possession. That was nice play. They used the clock. They have a lead. Smart play. And this is game is two and a half minutes from being over, but for all practical purposes, it is over now. Elijah Wan has 24. It's a 19-point Rockets lead. That's the biggest of the game. They're, they're playing like a, a team that uh, could be pretty good here in the future. Here's the unselfish play of the Rockets three passes and Elijah Wan buries the jump shot and then the fast break you're going to see Akeem come streaking into your screen and Akeem Elijah Wan with the slam dunk so they've blown this game out to 19 points Patrick Ewing sits down shot clock is off and wind it down oops here goes the 80 probably Wilkins that won't count Knicks 79 points. Rockets score 90. Get the victory. Knicks are 0 and 5 on the road. Rockets go to 7 and 2 on the season, and they are undefeated at home. And Pat Riley knows the big challenge that he's facing.